Solving the mystery. Only right in history. Duck tales. Every day they're out there making duck tales. Woo! Tales of daring, do bad, and good luck tales. Okay. Amazon, Transylvania, African Mines, Himalayas, or the moon? Start in the Amazon. Okay. You need to play this game. Oh! Now I found. Ah! Found money. Okay. Okay. You hit tree stumps, treasure box. Oh. It's weird. So you have to, like, hit. You have to, oh, you have to hold over and then push B. But B on its own does nothing. Oh, how did I do that? How am I doing that? Oh, okay, so if you hold down and B, you start pogo sticking. Oh, you don't have to hold you don't have to hold it anymore? Oh, you have to hold B. Hey, what's going on, Gerd? You have to hold B for it to bounce. This is like uh This is awesome. Woo! This is like uh, Zelda 2 here, but even better. Hey, Melly. That's not how you come into my stream, Melly. Knock it off. Get consistent. Okay, so I can whack these. Oh, there's ice cream. If I know anything about video game ice cream. Oh, it heals me. That's my. Oh, you can't bounce on those. <laughs> okay. All right. I already got seventy thousand dollars, and I just started. I guess that's not very much money in like Scrooge terms. <laughs> Everyone's back from Iceland tomorrow. Mm. How you doing, Gerd? Oh, don't go in there. I'm trying not to go in there. Oh, this thing looks like pop. Oh. So can I like? Oh, toe pound. Tiger Woods stuff. Uh, good. It's been a weird... Oh, am I like invincible now? I don't feel like I'm getting the most out of this invincibility. Uh, it's been a weird week. Uh, my wife Sarah has been in Iceland. So it's just been me and 18,000 kids. No, oh, that's NES for you. One second. Been a minute since I've seen that happen. Okay. The uh, hazards of playing with hardware. Okay, let's try the Amazon again. Um, I'm very much looking forward to her being back tomorrow. It's funny, when she was, like, going, I was like, wow, she's gonna be in. on vacation all week? I'll stream extra. And then I streamed less than I normally do. <laughs> Yeah, she sent some gorgeous pictures, and she was fortunate enough to see the uh, Aurora Borealis twice. She got to see it tonight and last night. Uh, she was very excited about that. Okay, so the ice cream wasn't worth money, so can I... Oh, broken here. Uh, oh gosh, this pogoing thing is hard to get started. It's easy to keep it going. It's just kind of a little awkward to get started. Ice cream wasn't worth money, so I'm, I'm going to guess health refill. Yeah, she was really pumped about that. Um, originally, they were scheduled to go earlier in the year, and she was worried she might miss them, but then their got, trip got delayed, and uh, she got to see them. She went to Iceberg Lagoon? I, I don't know if that's the same thing. Um, where the, Apparently, it's like a must-see kind of big attraction, big glacier, and just big chunks of ice just all over the place. She just sent us a couple pictures from there today. Um, it's really cool looking. There's just money appearing wherever I go. I guess that's how it is for rich people. like And and rich ducks. Why did it take me so long to play a game where you play as a duck? Hopefully I finish this game before... No, Blue Lagoon is a hot spring that's just blue. Oh, I don't know if she went and saw that. She's not like the biggest fan of hot springs. I like hot springs. Oh, come here, get wrecked. Oh! Oops, I thought I hit it too early, but... Apparently I was just... 
I'm gonna have to bounce on that. Oh gosh, I'm gonna mess this up. Ugh. Called it. Oh! Luckily there was like a cake or something there. Refill my health. She said that there was um, at the Airbnb where they were staying. Come here, spider with only six legs. Um, a jacuzzi, like a hot tub that was fed from like a mineral springs nearby, or, n nearby hot springs. I guess in Iceland they're all about like sustainability and environmental conscientiousness and stuff. We got treasures lurking in these Oh, now we got bees. I'm gonna guess. I'm not gonna guess. I'm gonna. Well, I am gonna guess, but then I'm gonna verify that this goes back to where I was before. So going downstairs there was like totally pointless. Ah. Mm -hmm. I was a bit jelly. She uh, like got cheap tickets. Oh, but that one didn't spawn treasure. It spawned a flower that ate me. <laughs> well, where do I start? Oh, is this the beginning again? Uh, she so she got it was like discounted tickets. She's like, should I go to Iceland? Just joking, because some internet ad targeted her, and I was like, you should go to Iceland. Go have fun. Invite your brother and sister. And she's like, really? I'm like, yeah. Why not? Go go to Iceland. <laughs> Here we are. <laughs> and now I'm jealous. Oh, I already got that. Okay. Oh, this is the thing. Yep, it does make you invincible. And yep, it just goes back around. So yeah, downstairs there was totally pointless, I guess. I guess money. I don't know how you, if you need money in this game. My initial impression is that money is like a high score. About as useful as points in Mega Man. Jump. Oh, yeah. This game actually, like, stylistically kind of reminds me of Mega Man. Okay. Oh gosh. Ah. Like, the graphics and the music very much uh, giving me, like, uh, <clears throat> Mega Man vibes. Is this made by Capcom? Who made this game? I bet Capcom made this game. Come to think of it. Is it laggy? Is what laggy? The game? No, that that was just me being a doofus. <laughs> Enjoy your chores. <laughs> oh, oh, man, I got some ice cream. Or are you asking if the stream is laggy? Because that's a different... Uh, no, I'm playing this on my PBM. Ooh. Oh, and I was trying to say earlier, but I get distracted because I do that. Um, that I'm taking my PBM into the shop, my, my TV, so I may have to switch to some PC games for a while. <laughs> may not beat this one um, before I get my... Oh, what was it? Oh, gosh, this game is brutal. And it messed up again. I like that color, though. <laughs> All right. Oi. Oh, what is going on with this game? No. 
think I just like corrupted the ROM on my SD card there. Uh, I don't think we could do World of Illusion next week because I don't have a television. I mean, we could play it directly on OBS. It just would have a uh, lag. Technical difficulties, indeed. I'm working on it. I'm going to delete that DuckTales ROM. And try that again. I've never seen that happen with my EverDrive. The game crashed, and then the ROM wouldn't load anymore. It was like somehow it got corrupted. Never seen my EverDrive fail that way. Okay, one second. Booty boop. Boop booty boop. Well, that was something else, huh? Oh, I have an EverDrive for Sega Genesis anyway. Snega. <laughs> I have a, I had a bootleg uh, Game Boy Advance uh, game. Um, I'm not even bother going downstairs this time. Um, but yeah, no, I could. In fact, I'm. I might already have the game on my EverDrive. Ah, I was trying to that. <laughs> I didn't realize it would slide like that. You want to do it like legit, legit, huh? I have a Sega Genesis. What model Sega Genesis do you have? Do you know? Oh, yeah, here we go. This is what I'm talking about. This one that spawned a flower? No, okay. How do I get up there? Oh, off the bee. Excellent. <laughs> Gosh. I super probably don't need any of these treasure chests, but just, I see them and I must have them. I also don't think my cartridge is real, is the true problem. <laughs> but you can bring it, it doesn't matter. Uh, okay, I can't land there. Oh gosh. Oof. Ah, yeah, this feels very Mega Man y right now. Hey, launch pad, you gonna take. Why don't you just take me to the... Oh, into the bee. Why don't you just take me directly into the bee launch pad? Oh, bro. <laughs> Absolutely want to know what happens when it's played, so for sure. Okay, cool. Are we doing... Is it cookie weekend this weekend? This next weekend? I hope that invincibility thing is back. Speaking of hump humbugs, what about them bees? Sure could use an ice cream or cake. I'm saying it's in my parents' house and I hear oh. <laughs> Alright, come on. Come on, Scrooge. That's what happens when you send old man out in the world. Why didn't he send his young nephews? Ah. I guess they're busy minding the shop in Traverse Town. Why did I stop bouncing? Bounce. 
the, the, the way you activate and maintain the bounce is so weird. You have to hold B and down to start the bounce, and you only have to hold B to keep it going, but you have to bounce at least once before that's true. Matt, stop knocking my screen. <laughs> this game is so hard. Go away, Mac. I accidentally locked Mac in the room when I started streaming. And now she doesn't know who I'm talking to. Ah. That launch pad. Did you maybe not run me right into a bee this time? Thanks. Although, I'm crediting my own accidentally spawning the bee for that. Not any sort of... Uh... Oh, look. You can't... Oh, I'm not... That's what's happening. I'm like... My stick isn't hitting the... Wait, but... I didn't know that would happen. I kind of thought they would fall, but I thought they would fall after I touched them, not after I flew over them. Oh, come on. I see you up there. What was the point of that? Some ice cream. You are better than this. <laughs> Am I, though? Hey, there's lunch, bud. What do we got here? Cake? Uh, money? I want cake or ice cream. Right. What's your deal, lunch, bud? You want to lift back to Duckburg, Mr. McD? Yes, A. No, B. Not yet. Wait, do I? Did I beat the level? Oh! Oh, oh my gosh! I can't believe I didn't die right there. Ah! <laughs> I didn't know it was about to get all Indiana Jones on me there. Oh, no! Oh, I got speared by some kind of monkey or rat? Wow, this game is not playing! That's how hard this game is? I'm supposed to... I don't think I'm here for money. I read the manual last week. And I'm pretty sure it said there's like a special treasure in each land you gotta get. So I think the money is kind of extraneous. Not that I like would mind having or anything. It's just not uh, necessary. What I need to get is, like, some, I don't know, rare Amazon treasure. Oh. Humbug. Geez. That was all accidental. Okay, how did I do this last time? That's how I did it. Yeah, follow that bee. Keeps other bees from spawning, apparently. Gosh, that's freaky. <laughs> it's so freaky, I feel like I'm doing it wrong. What kind of gorillas are in the Amazon? What kind of Amazon is this? I mean, killer duck eating plants, yes. Okay. Now this mess. Oh, you can't start it that early. I started it too early. I didn't know there were spikes on top, too. Oh, at least I started here, though. That's nice. Okay, so I gotta get past those spikes. Then do this mess. Is that food? It's not food. Of course it's not food. I would have not died in one hit last time if that were food. Oh, no. I could have used that to kill that spider bee. I kind of want to see if I can respawn that yellow block. Oh! Being better! I didn't know that was going to be there. Fantastic. Um, how on earth do I get... <laughs> I guess... You do need money in this game. 300,000. Alright. Let's go get some money. Of course I need money. What's wrong with you? Why wouldn't I need money? Did you spear? That spear ate my rock. I'm gonna... Come here, rat. 
You little Q-tip spears. Oh my goodness. Micro, micro, $300,000 in a micro, Melissa. All right. Yeah, let's go back to Duckburg. Oh, I take my money with me? I was kind of hoping it would reset my lives. Oh, so I could bring money in from other places. Oh, but I still only have... I'm so low on lives. And there's... Is there any form of continuing at all? I gotta get 300,000? It's just... No way. Well, maybe. Let's see. Each one of those is worth... 10,000? Okay, yeah. No, we can do it. And the little ones are worth 1,000? Oh, the little ones are worth 2,000. That's a lot of Skrill to be scrounging up, though. But I definitely do have to go down there. Get wrecked, flower! Ah! Ape! Weird South American ape? Alright, we're gonna go down this way. We'll come back. Because there was some treasure over here. Too lofty a game for me? Aww. There's no way it's harder than Echo the Dolphin. <laughs> I thought it was a, a good time for Kingdom Hearts. A good segue away from Kingdom Hearts. To keep it Disney. Oh, look. We're, we're halfway there already. Look, we're making plenty of money. Maybe I should have just practiced this one before I started, jumped right into streaming it, you know? Which I have way more times than Echo. You are just misremembering Echo, I promise you. I died plenty on Echo. You know? What was that? Th oh, that was a one-up! Oh, I definitely want to come down here. Get the one-up. Come here, beast fighter. What's your deal? You gonna lunge for me or not? None of these ones have treasures in them, huh? There was like something over there though. I don't know what it was. Treasure, maybe. <laughs> oh, look at this. We are cooking. Look at all that money. Oops. Ah. That's the one that had the flower in it, right? Yeah. Okay, let's get this. Invincibility. Oh, I kind of thought I would get some treasures from killing those flowers for some reason. I did not get treasures for killing those flowers. Okay. Oh gosh. Even with all that, I'm, st I'm still not getting quite up to 300,000. Well, maybe. Well, maybe. I only need, like, five more of those big ones. Five more big ones. <laughs> nice green. I do love this bouncing mechanic. It's super fun. It's, like, kind of tough to do right, but when it does work, it's, it's good times. I love this bee spawning trick that I invented. We're gonna call that the Mickey Bee. Ah! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm all the way back here. Uh, okay. 256 down. But like, I know what I'm doing now, right? Like, I'm better at the game than when I started? That's true, man. <laughs> hey! Whoa, where'd that come from? Ooh, another hidden 10 grand up there. Alright, okay. So we're only 30 grand short of that elevator. And that elevator will probably just take me directly to the treasure. It's not like it's gonna take me into, you know, more rooms full of hazards. In fact, it'll probably just give me like five one-ups. And the Amazon treasure. Actually, I think it's going to make that vine come down. Ow. One of these days, I'm just going to pay attention to how to kill that bee. Okay, so you can't begin your bounce on a monster? Is that what just happened? Oh. 
Maybe I should put it on easy, huh? <laughs> Maybe I'm not... Maybe I'm not ready for normal difficulty. I <laughs> do a death counter, but I lost count already. It's zero. I haven't died yet. You're thinking of a different DuckTales game. Oh, it didn't give me a treasure that time. These monsters, like, only sometimes give you treasures when you kill them. Okay, and this wasn't worth coming back for, but there was, like, a... Okay, there's a gem in this one. And then there was, like, a secret gem hidden in the tree. Oh, two of them that time. Okay, that's cool. All right. Then all this treasure over here. Ooh. I'll take that. The music's good. Two ice creams. What would anybody need two ice creams for that? Oh, maybe ice creams do one hit point. Well, then what does cake do? Give me that skrill. Boom, 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 boom. Maybe I'm starting in the wrong level. Maybe Amazon's the hardest level. Come on, spider bee. I'm gonna get hit here because there's no way not to, apparently. But it's okay because there's a cake. And a wanna. I made Jason bring me ice cream. Apparently, I'm being cranky. <laughs> I'm getting a little hangry. Gosh, ice cream does suck. No, I don't want ice cream. Dairy Queen's closed. Okay, so what is this? Is this treasure over here? It was treasure. It was just one of those little gems. Okay, let's. Rube Goldberg the snake. Gem out of this tree trunk. I think that's it for treasure that way. I don't remember anymore that way. Mm. Ooh, that thing flew right through my top hat. Brought the wrong spoon. Do you like big spoons or small spoons with your ice cream? Because I hate big spoons for ice cream. I gotta have the small spoon. In most other cases, I don't mind the big soup spoon, but for ice cream, I gotta have the little tiny dessert spoon. The teaspoon. Oh, hurry up. Oh, launch pad? It's not helpful. I only use chowder spoons for everything. Oh, so you don't like the small spoon. You like the big boy. Yeah, you gotta land with it just right. <laughs> okay, checkpoint though. And I think this was. No, this was money. Yes! 300,000. Fits nicely in your mouth. Hey, whatever works for me. Oh! I don't know why I didn't. I, I thought I pushed the buttons. The game did not agree. At least that timer resets when you die. Also, at least you don't lose all your money. Okay. Now, where was that hidden M that I accidentally stumbled onto last time? Is it in here? Yeah, there it is. Excellent. Oh, get wrecked, nerds. All right. I got your money. Not oh, need a little elevator. What? Get on the elevator. Is this, why is this thing so... Mm. Oh, hey! What's up, Huey? Or wait, no, you're Dewey. Use your cane to defeat the treasure keepers. What's my treasure keep? What's a trick? There's a boss. Oh, and there's an extra extra life. There's bosses, Melissa. That's what it's saying. There's boss monsters. Oh! Why didn't I realize that would happen? Oh, come on. How am I even supposed to... 
What's down in that hole, you think? Does it just go back to launch pad? Well, it does go back to launch pad. <sighs> what looks like a big whopper? Oh, now that M's gonna be gone, isn't it? It's not here. <laughs> Whoa, you called me Michael. I must be in real trouble. <laughs> Come on, spider. Oh, yeah. Look at those the parkour skills. Dude, you can't make me do it again. This game is so mean. What? I already paid for it. I... I don't even know what to... Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm quitting video games. Unbelievable. I was just... I just... Every... Let me... Just thought it was a hole I could go in. Alright, launch pad. Since I've plundered all the treasures of the Amazon, you gotta take me back. So we can try it again. <laughs> Okay, that hole is just a death pit. That hole is not, like, a, a way to get anywhere. At least maybe I can get those one-ups again. One-ups I wouldn't need if I weren't jumping in pits out of curiosity. <sighs> this game is as mean as Mega Man so far. Maybe even meaner than Mega Man. At least in Mega Man, you would be like an asshole. Like this one was a hole, so I thought maybe only holes with vines are ones you can jump in. I guess I never tried jumping in any of the holes on the right side of this screen, so I really can't say it wasn't fair of the game, but whatever. You should have seen me the first time I played through Star Tropics. You only saw me play through Star Tropics like on stream after I'd beaten that game. I died in that game about 18 million times. Um, before I beat it. There's just so many places where it, there's there's rooms in that game, like doorways you walk through, that when you walk through them, you just die. Like, that's not a joke. Like, there's not monsters on the other side or something that kill you. You just go into the door and you come out the door and die. <laughs> and there's rooms like that in Star Travis. Or there's lots of like little trick rooms where it's like, here's the staircase, and you go on the staircase, and it just takes you back out of the level, and you have to start over again. It's so mean and unfair. I mean, it's not unfair as long as you like remember, I guess, which ones were where, and don't do it again. You're really not supposed to like repeat your mistakes in Star Traffic. You're really supposed to like learn from them. Okay. Money situation's looking good. Probably would be easier to jump off that beat. And I can never remember if this one is ice cream or my ice cream. Oh, it almost worked. I almost ducked in the right spot. Insert duck joke. I did that like way too late. Yeah, no thanks. That is not what I was looking for there. I did it again. Wow, I lined them up like perfectly. That could be. Okay, this strat is just not working for me. Okay, here we go. Let's try this the right way this time. That might have been a little. Damn. Mm. I goofed it all up. Deck jokes are always too foul. <laughs> nice one. Oh, 
always feels like I'm not gonna make that. Freaky deaky. Okay. Come on. What? Where'd he go? Why isn't he there? Can you only, like, use him once per game? What kind of weirdness is that? Ah. But they still quack me up! <laughs> nice! Right, let's get the invincibility. Ooh, that thing dropped an ice cream! Thanks, bee spider! All right, you greedy statue. Okay, and then I get another bonus life here. I guess it would be kind of cheating if you just kept coming back here and like farming lives and then launch pad McQuacking out. Okay, but how do I do this part here? Oh, I did it. Nice. By being a boss, that's how. Okay, that's a death pit. It's not. Oh, ooh, is it all? Oh, I was this close to the boss? Oh, oh, it interferes with my pogoing. Oh, also, it's got iframes. Okay. It's got iframes, and it, like, stuns my pogo. So I gotta get in and get out of there. And it probably takes only 700 hits. Oh, man. I lost my M again. Get wrecked. Oh, it missed! <sighs> this is not the condition. Oh my gosh, I forgot about this! <laughs> and I don't even have launch pad! So what am I supposed to do? I can't... Am I supposed to just die? But I already did. So you just have to beat the boss in one go, otherwise, game over. Oh, I guess I could farm these things. Yeah, keep dropping me gems. This is like Rhaegar all of a sudden. Come on, give me some more gems. I need quite a, quite a few more. I'm gonna run out of time before I get enough gems. I didn't actually think this would work. I thought it was only going to drop the one gem. <laughs> no. I expect you to die. No, Mr. Bolt. Mr. Scrooge. Oh. Well, I got a third of the way back to the greedy statue's bear. Unreal. And maybe, you know, I saw that spider drop ice cream earlier. Maybe I can get another one to drop ice cream. Heal me a little bit, too. Or, you know, just not take all the damage in the world. Doesn't it kind of look like I could upgrade my hit points at some point? There's, like, only three there now, but it looks like there's space for more. Oh, gosh. Michael. All right, come down a little bit. Oh. Thank you. Oh, I hit it too early. Come on down, spider. I knew it. They timed that perfectly. So let's just game over. Like, there's no keeping any of that money with me. Oh, gosh. All right. All right, game. Yeah, this is not going to get beaten before, um, <laughs> before my TV goes into the shop. Absolutely no way. Can I get it from here? Oh no, that one like... For some reason, that one's weird. This one I can get it with. But it doesn't always drop money anyway. Boo, 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 boo. 
Gosh, I had no idea this game was this difficult. Oh, you won't come down. Okay. Thought maybe I could get you to come down and pogo on you. No? You don't want to come down? I don't really understand the uh, AI of those spiders. Or why hey, they have six legs and look like bees. I wonder if, like, the easy difficulty has, like, is more forgiving, like, the elevator stays there, or... Um, oh, maybe that's where you get more hit points, is on easy mode. Maybe you don't upgrade your health, maybe you just have more on easy mode. I timed it wrong again. He's not spawning early enough now. Ah. Actually, that would have worked. Mm. B, where are you when I need you? No. Oh, oh. Hey, that worked. More than other ones? That one seemed like it was worth like 50,000. I wasn't really paying attention though. No. Oh, oh, that's one way to. Is it gonna bounce back? No. Like that. Oh, come on, Michael. Not that it matters, like, if I don't beat the boss, I gotta go back to Duckburn. I'm gonna get the. The quote two shots of this. Oh, that treasure chest didn't spawn even though I haven't opened it yet. Because I never opened it. I spawned it, but I never opened it, so I've like lost access to it apparently. Yeah, a little extra money. Alright, come on. Let's get, get my useless one up. More like dump bird. <laughs> Alright, I got it this time. Okay. Cool. Stun. Yeah, you're gonna stay away from it. I mean, this boss isn't like terribly complicated or anything. The level was way worse than the boss. That was it for the boss? Alright. We got the tr Oh! Hey! That showed up on the computer in the little select screen where I could pick my level. Whoa! And now I'm loaded? Is that a million? Whoa! Okay, now you, ah, I got money. Okay. Now I can afford that thing. So yeah, see, look there on the side where it's got that little glowing coin thing? Yeah, that's the treasure I'm looking for. I want some stinky moon cheese. Um... I don't know, a little snow globe? A gem, obviously. What else would you find in an African mine? And a shiny coin. 
Oh, and I can't go back to the Amazon. It won't let me in there again. Okay. Let's check out Transylvania. Also, what on earth is this map at the top here? Okay, I see the moon, but like the Himalayas. So that's like Asia, like Tibet, right? So then why is Africa like east, southeast of the Himalayas? Is this map like, no, even if it were upside down, it should go up. And then Transylvania is over there by the Himalayas? Goodness knows where the Amazon even was. Okay, yeah. Let's go check out these vampires. These are my relatives. <laughs> Looks like a map I'd make. Oh, okay, we've got duck skeletons. Wait a minute. That money I got in the other level doesn't count. It doesn't carry over. It's just part of my total money that I've collected. It's not money I get to spend in this level. Oh. Are you something, Mirror? Do you do anything? You're just decor? Okay. Are you gonna not come to life, Armor? Oh, you're just... Okay. Hey, Wendy! Help! Huey has been kidnapped. Save him, please. What am I doing? I'm invincible. Not anymore, I'm not. <laughs> Michelle made me draw a map once, didn't have Asia, and didn't know Africa was connected. <laughs> I thought you meant like a D and D map. Oh hey, I found the guy who kidnapped kidnapped. Here we kidnapped you. Thanks, Uncle Scrooge. Guess what? This house has an illusion wall. Okay, so there's a wall that I can walk through. Kidnapper's back. Is it this wall? Oh! Not this wall. Why would I need that invincibility? What would I use it on? Oh, would have been great right there. Can I whack this guy's um, ball at him? Yes, I can! Fantastic. And I needed to because I wasted my invincibility. Oh, the ball stays. Interesting. Nope, world map. I also had to draw a US map and only had the border states. East Coast, West Coast, Middle. <laughs> Look at these coffins. Can I knock them open? Oh, I can! There's ghosts in them! Can I kill the ghosts? You can't... I, I don't think... No idea how the middle is broken up. I'm not saying I could draw a map of the United States. I'd probably have a little more on there than that, but... There'd be, there'd be some, some of New England would be missing, for sure. Oh, hello. And some of the, like, Midwest would be all scrambled up, too, like... Iowa, Idaho, I don't know. Uh, wait, Idaho's not even in the Midwest! <laughs> I meant Ohio and Iowa. Oh, and I made all of South America, Mexico. That's definitely not. Let's check this way first this time. Do I need to rescue Huey again, or is he still rescued? Ah, a ghost. You can't spawn in a hallway where I can't... I don't have any weapons to fight you with. Ghost! Get some continues though. If you can jump on the ghosts, ah. no, you definitely, you <sighs> maybe. Like, I, my stick was just like two pixels to the right of that ghost's shoulder, and I'm usually 
NES games don't have, like, that good a collision detection. Like, yeah, see, my stick didn't even hit that thing, really. I think you can't hurt the ghosts. I don't understand how it can hurt me physically. That makes very little sense to me, but that seems to be the case. Oh, make up your mind, ghost. These ghosts are a bother. <laughs> All right, well, we know how to beat the Amazon. So now we just start in Transylvania. <sighs> Hopefully I don't have to rescue Huey before I can get anything else done here. No, stop wasting my M! Wake up! Now I wasted my M. I didn't... I thought I could kind of hurt that thing while it was on the floor with my M. I know I couldn't hurt it with my stick, but I thought my M might help. Just... Ah. They don't really have any problem hitting me, though. treasure room. Oh, does that mirror take me back up to the other mirror? Please take me back up to the other mirror. Fantastic. Okay. So if you go all the way that way, I don't have to come back through ghost hell. Yeah, Webby. I called her Wendy. <laughs> Webby. Yeah, that's Webby. Ah. Okay, now was there another thing over here, though? There wasn't, like, another... I think I missed, was there? I'm gonna guess some dude. Whoa! See, like, I didn't even barely touch that one and it died. Okay, let's go save Huey first. Get wrecked. Yeah. Man, I loved her. Did you ever watch that movie with uh, the genie? Shabooey! We, we had, we like recorded that one, you know, we rented it from Blockbuster and then recorded it and watched it a million times. Made a, you know, bootleg copy of it. Loved that one. Okay. Oh! Let's not go whacking any graves this time. The restless dead. Hate it. Okay. We've got a rope up there. Ice cream, bro. Ah. ah, there's the illusion wall. I found it. Hit <gasps> point upgrade! Yeah, I made Jason watch a few months ago, and I said it was pivotal. Absolutely. That's not pivotal to childhood. Excellent. I think it was called DuckTales and the Secret of the Lamp or something like that. We the I, That was like one of our first ever movie nights. Sarah and I had the girls watch it. They liked it all right, but it was not pivotal to their childhoods. I like to imagine they could see why it was pivotal, pivotal to ours, though. Can I? Yes. And it's a one-up. Oh, Transylvania's great. Okay, is that a... Oh, there's more than one illusion wall. Okay, I feel like that's the one you come back to. Oh, dear. It's a mirror maze. Ew, no. Treasures of the Lost Lamp. Thank you. What did I say? Secret of the Lost Lamp or something? So I got the Lost Lamp for right. And then there was, like, another one. I can't remember. I didn't watch it as much, but there was, like... They built some kind of giant jiggling jello to, like... Break down buildings or something? It's a big giant green jello. Hey, what's going on, Gert? Incoming what? Who's incoming? 
Hopefully somebody can know how to beat this game. Oh. Ray. Oh yeah, but who's Ray? That was a wish. Okay. Nothing there. Get wrecked. <laughs> oh! Can this go? Oh no. Okay. I thought for a second that could go like further up. Okay, so this mirror will take me a place. A minecart kind of thing? Okay. I gotta check out what those, those, those two other mirrors. <laughs> that happen? Alright. You got a duck in the minecart to not get your face smashed. Oh, and you need the minecart. See, I didn't even think I needed the minecart. I was just gonna walk down the hall, but I wanted the minecart. And good thing, too, because I needed it. Any secret walls here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Oh! One-way trip. That was weird. I still had, like, a hold on it somehow. Okay, well there's some stuff. Yeah. Ah. There we go. Oh! Come here, ice cream. Oh my gosh, this place is a total maze. Ooh, a one-up, that's good. Okay, I hope someone was keeping track of which ways I've gone, because I wasn't. Is that the mirror back? Oh hey, I'm on the other side of that thing! Weird, because I went down and down and down and down, and now I'm... I got polter pupped! <laughs> Get... oh, what the... I didn't see that coming. What's going on, ghost dog? I was actually lurking in your stream earlier today. How far did you get in Resident Evil? Thanks for the raid, and thanks everybody for me. Oh my... Culture pup friends. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Mickey Dad Rab. I take care of kids. I play old video games, and I make stuff out of yarn. Wait, I, that mirror doesn't take me back. You're about. To, oh, you. Okay. You're about to start five. Resident Evil five. Oh, oh, you. Oh, the ch the chapter. I got you. I got you. Okay, okay. Cool, cool. I love Resident Evil four. It's funny because like the first time I played Resident Evil 4, I was like, this game is terrible. Because I love Resident Evil 2 and Resident Evil 3 and Resident Evil 1. Like, but I played them out of order. And so then I played Resident Evil 4 and I was like, this is what? I hate this. And then my friend came over to my house and he saw that I owned it. He's like, you have Resident Evil 4? I'm like, yeah, but that game's terrible. I hate it. And he's like, no, this game is great. Oh, I'm gonna run out of time because I'm jabber John. And uh, then he played it and showed me how to play it. And then I fell in love with it. And I spent a good two years, you know, playing that game and unlocking all the secrets. And I loved that one. And then I really, really, really loved uh, Resident Evil 5. In fact, I played Resident Evil 5 a few times on stream <laughs> with my brother-in-law. Oh, so if I knock the head off this thing, then I can get back over there. Oh. Ah. Yeah, I, it just, it, it didn't click with me at first. Once I, like... Saw it smooth out though. I find that with, with a lot of video games though. Like, I'm like, I don't get it. And then I see somebody else play it for a little bit and I'm like, I get it. I want to play it. I was the same way with Fallout 3. Uh, that same friend, in fact, who made me play Resident Evil 4, he gave me Fallout 3. Like, he just gave me the game and I was like, meh, I don't like it. It's no fun. And then my brother played Fallout 3 and I watched him play it and I was like, I gotta play this. It's so good. Oh, first intro to the Resident Evil franchise. Watching my brother play it, hiding behind the couch. <laughs> a little ghost pup back then. Oof. My brother, he used to... He, so I have, I have older and younger brothers, but my older brother, he... Um, he was the... He played Resident Evil 2 quite a bit. Um, and so Resident Evil 2 was my first one. And I remember one time, I, w I ran down some hallway. I got into some room in Resident Evil 2. And uh, then I got called into like, we were going to say family prayers for the evening or something. So I was like, oh, okay. And my older brother was an apostate, so he didn't pray with the family. So I gave him the controller. And I'm like, hey, get me back to the save room. Hey, thanks for the follow, Ryan Lochner. And thanks for that, Psyduck. And uh, I go, we say family prayers. I come back and he's moved like three feet. And I'm like, David, what are you doing? You didn't get me anywhere, you jerk. And so I take the controller back, 
and I, I take like two more steps and this liquor falls out of the ceiling. It scares me to death. I'm like, oh, and he starts laughing. He's like, hey, hey, hey. that's why I didn't move you. Oh, what a punk. That one, ugh. that one scared me. <laughs> got me good. Oh, okay. So now I got two other mirrors. Wait, I don't, th I didn't fully explore that one because I went in there. But then I went down the minecart side. I didn't go there. Yeah, very big brother thing to do. But yeah, I love those Resident Evil games. I was in love with the Resident Evil games before we even owned a PlayStation. Because like my brother, oh, we're going to run out of time. Um, would go to his friend's house and make VHS tapes of like recordings of them playing PlayStation. He brought home footage of Resident Evil 2. And I was like, that game looks amazing. <laughs> Okay, let's go see. So there was, yeah, I didn't go down here. What's down here? Oh, oh, go back up. <laughs> More treasure. Okay, so now I'm playing DuckTales anyway. I figured it out. And this game is freakishly hard. <laughs> the first Twitch, VHS, VHS Let's Plays. That's, that's what we did before we had Twitch, Melissa. Oh! Now I'm back at the beginning. I kind of wanted to check if that right wall was a um, illusion wall, but it wasn't. I have a ton of money this time, though. It was in the Amazon earlier, and it was brutal. There was this statue. Like, I didn't collect money because I was like, well, what good is money? Obviously, the point of the game isn't money. Well, turns out there's this little guardian statue that's like, I'll build you an elevator if you give me $300,000, and I had collected no money. So... Then I went and did collect the $300,000 and died on the boss. Well, actually, first I died jumping in a pit to see if it was indeed a pit. And it was a pit, and I died. And then... Uh, then I died on the boss, and when you die, the elevator goes away, and the statue wants another $300,000. And you can't even make that much in the level. It was so brutal. <laughs> anyway, we figured out how to beat the Amazon. I'm not saying I could do it again easily, but like I solved the Amazon. So now I'm working on Transylvania. <laughs> the first Twitch was that and also sleepovers. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Video game sleepovers. Yeah. This, this, these are the kinds of games I played on video game sleepovers. Dragon Warrior, Mega Man, and all the NES games. Yeah. Little bit of Super Nintendo here and there. Like, uh... Link to the Past on Super Nintendo. I wonder if I broke his little ball if he can wander free now. Okay. We have thoroughly explored that mirror. Let's go check these other two. I got two other mirrors over here. Oh, useless. Okay. Oh, come on. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yup. I probably won't finish this game for a long time because I'm taking my TV into the shop on Monday. And it might be a month before I get my TV back. So we might be switching over to some PC games for a while. Some uh, Doom, maybe. Some Duke Nukem. Not Duke Nukem 3D. The original Duke Nukem. The side-scroller one. Ah, leave me alone, ghost. Gosh. How much money do you think... Is that... Oh, it doesn't even look like floor. I thought that was a pit. You don't do sleepovers. I guess you do, huh? <laughs> you know, she's probably not lying. I bet that's true. Okay. Okay, so here's the boss. Um, a little bit. A little bit of Unreal Tournament. Um, I thought that game was amazing. Um, it was just like a little... Like... I want to say that came out... When did, when did Unreal Tournament come out? I can't remember exactly why I didn't play more of it. I loved Unreal. I remember thinking Unreal was um, photorealistic. I remember playing Unreal and like trying to look around corners by moving my head because I was so engrossed in the game um, or getting vertigo looking down in holes. And I remember playing a bit of Unreal Tournament, but I want to say like I didn't play a ton of it because uh, like I started playing an MMORPG um, around the same time it came out or something. 
And so I just got sucked into that. Super Mario Sunshine being a sleepover game. Wow, you're you're making me feel old, Ghost Dog. <laughs> I've never actually played Super Mario Sunshine. Uh, being a sleepover game for me and my friend, uh, and be my best friend, we would literally restart the game all the time because we always got brickwalled by one time. <laughs> Unreal Tournament 97, I think. Yeah, yeah. So it was Ashron's Call. Ashron's Call got in the way of me playing a ton of Unreal Tournament. I remember thinking that that was the smartest AI I'd ever seen, like an AI that actually dodged attacks. Um, like that versus uh, first-person shooters that had come before it. Went to the Reeves place and started playing Detroit Human. I left at 4 a.m., I think, did a straight playthrough. Also had them over last big snow. We all played Minecraft over here. Nice. Okay, we're fighting this... Uh... Oh, she's like a witch. Okay. So I gotta hit her when she's on the ground? Is that the... Yeah, okay. Well, at least I didn't have to pay to get to this boss. That's That's nice. Super Mario Sunshine. I did not play a ton of GameCube, just in general. Um, I, told, I feel like I told this story a hundred times on stream before, but I did play GameCube before it was released. I went to this uh, back when he was Puff Daddy um, GameCube pre-release party and got to, they had a whole bunch of GameCube set up and we played some Pikmin and some Luigi's Mansion, a little bit of Smash Bros. Um, but then, like, a week later, I joined the Marine Corps, so I just never played GameCube again, like, until I got married, and... Yeah, I did. I got a, a HP upgrade, and, said, and, like, my wife had a GameCube. Uh, like, well, she was my girlfriend then, so, like, I played on her GameCube a little bit, but mostly just Mario Kart. Yeah, he hasn't been Puff Daddy in a long time, Gerd. He was P. Diddy, and then he was... Just Diddy, and then he was like Diddy Dirty Money. Yeah, he hasn't been Puff Daddy in 25 years. <laughs> okay, this might be easier if I just don't bounce around. Ah, oh, you can hit. Oh, no, you can't because she's got iframes. Ow, okay, this is not easy. Okay. Uh, okay, yeah, ooh. Nice. Come on, you. I, I can't believe I hit her. That worked kind of well, huh? Diddy is Puff Daddy? <laughs> I feel like you're trolling me, Gary. I know, I actually, like, maybe I don't think you're trolling me, though, because every once in a while I hear some name, and I'm like, is that a person I already know? Like, when I first heard the name Khalid, I'm like, is that the same person as the all we do is win guy then p diddy then just don't diddy <laughs> i'm not law i didn't actually start paying attention to these calls in college <laughs> my my music exposure was also like weirdly um yeah full of holes like, what you would think I would recognize, like, 90s radio jams and stuff, because I'm the right age for that. But um, I grew up in, like, an orthodox religion, so we didn't listen to that kind of music. <laughs> listen to a bunch of country music and folk music, because that's what my parents listened to. Ah, come on. Oh. Oh, goodness. Oh, the hitboxes on those. I didn't mean don't. Oh, then just Diddy, you meant? Well, hey, we made it to the boss. That's something, right? It was not an easy boss. But yes, this is where the, the I got a, the hit point upgrade here, Melissa. It was in a, a treasure chest through one of the uh, invisible walls. So apparently I don't even need money in this place. Money's not... Leave me alone, Webby. Money doesn't have a practical use here. I listen to, like, primarily Smash Mouth and Bare Naked Lady. I listen to a little bit of that. Like stuff my friends downloaded on Napster. I just went downstairs to get tea and my random Raichu figure by the door was on the ground. This may be the start. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wanted. Ah, your ghost. Oh, I actually made it under the ghost that time. It may be the first time I made it past that ghost without getting hit. Here, treasure I don't need. Can I get that treasure? Oh, I gotta be higher. Ooh!
Napster. Yeah, remember Napster? What? I want this open. What? Oh, you gotta hit it from there, huh? That's interesting. Oh, this is where I got spiked before. Okay. Alright. And this is where I found a bunch of treasure I don't need, apparently, because you don't need treasure in this level. Did need it in the Amazon, though. Alright, so I can skip that part. Webby. No. And we can just go straight up here. Okay, and there's... This is where Huey has been kidnapped by this buffoon. I don't know what rescuing him does, or if I need to. He tells me there's an illusion wall. Um, which is like a helpful tip, I guess. But if you already know it, I don't know if there's any point in um, rescuing him. Oh, I got kidnapped again. Oh, no! The M makes you invincible for a short time. And, like, immediately kill any enemies you run into. Oh, I got a star in Mario games. Boo, 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 boo. And then there was, a uh, what was over here? Invisible... This, I think this is the hit point upgrade right here, Melissa. Yeah, a little star. Oh, and it heals you, too. That's nice. Double nice. It's got anything in it? Nope. Okay. Bling, 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 bling. Okay. And up here. Knock that chest down. Oh, yeah, for a 1-up. That's good. I was about to say, we don't really need it, because it's probably just... I think there was also another 1-up through the left mirror here. But let's go give the boss another shot. Well, another three shots. Get out of here, ghost. Whoa! <laughs> oh, no! Get... Oh, ghost! Come on. You can't pogo on the ghosts, so... They're just kind of scary. Hey, that worked out pretty good. Ah! Oh, come on! No! That was not cool. Oh! <laughs> she got me! Ghosts? Leave me alone. <laughs> Wonder if I can kill a ghost with the bricks. Ah, leave me alone, ghost. Ah. <laughs> I do not know how to avoid these ghosts. Okay, there we go. Alright. Come on, Vampira. What's this duck's name? I feel like I remember this duck from the cartoon, but I don't remember her name. Or why there's a witch in DuckTales. I guess there was a lot of supernatural weird stuff in DuckTales. That's not... Oh, wow. She's so low I could hit her while she's flying. Nice. Oh, booyah! Yeah! <laughs> All right. So now we got the ultimate treasure that's worth a bajillion dollars, but you can't carry this money to the next level, so it doesn't matter anyway. Magicka Dispel. Thank you, Gerd. Magicka Dispel. Okay. So I know how to beat Transylvania, and I know how to beat... Amazon. And yeah, when you beat a level, you like can't go back to it again. African Mines, huh? And here, we're looking for a giant diamond. Ow. What the? Oh, hey, what's up, Louie? You'll need a key to get in. It's in Transyl... I just came from there. What? Um... Where's the key? 
Do I just go to the boss again? Um, all the stuff is gone. All the treasure is gone. Was I supposed to go to African Mine first? What? Game? Can I get another health upgrade? <laughs> what is this? So you're not supposed to go there. So you come to the African mines. They send you to Transylvania, but there's no bus. So the key's just, what, hidden somewhere? Um, that's interesting. So I guess you should go to Africa before Transylvania? Oh, that's new. Yeah, there it is. Eureka, it's the skeleton key to the mine. The last time... That mirror was only an exit mirror. It was not an entrance mirror. There we go. Okay. Well, that's easy enough. So, actually, maybe you have to beat Transylvania before you can do the African mines? Because maybe that mirror only becomes that way after you beat it. Alright, anyway. Let's get in here. Oh, you just... You just walk through it. Is that a bat up there? Yeah. I saw you bat. What? I can't get out of here. I'm stuck. Oh, I want that treasure. Oh, no, I can't get that one. Humbug. Ice creams heal you by one hit point. There's also cakes that heal you for... I don't know, at least two hit points. Dork that up. Well, that slug is going nuts. Aha! Looks like I chose the correct path. I wonder if there's a. Nope. Okay. Just the ice cream and some money I may not need. Apparently, you don't need money in all the levels. You did need it in the Amazon, but I didn't need it at all in Transylvania. Whoop! Oh! <laughs> Woohoo! What is this? up nice okay we check the other way quick but there's a, a way down there through the invisible wall let's go check these more mundane paths oh hey mrs beakley what oh she's throwing ice cream all over the place that's her name right beakley am i supposed to bounce across this pit Well, that wasn't freaky at all. It's a hidden treasure. Yeah, Miss Beakley? Okay, I thought so. Okay, I found a hidden treasure over here. Can I not bounce back the same way I came? Oh! <clears throat> not like that, I can't. Ugh. That treasure chest I'll never be able to get. Gonna whip out some more ice creams? Yeah. I don't need them, but... Thanks. Okay, I wanna see what's over here past the, uh... Hidden treasure. Nope, oh, okay. Looks like it probably syncs up with the other path that came from over here. Oh! No, this is the boss? What is that? Oh! No, don't jump into it. This is all it does? Is this the boss or is this a mini boss? Ah. 
Gosh, gotta be faster than that. So I guess just jump regardless of which way it's gonna run. If it rolls the other way, just jump and fall. If it rolls toward you, jump over it. Either way, just jump toward the middle. Okay, so there's a boss that way. I don't know if it's the boss. So no, the answer was no. That did not sync up. This is a different thing. Is that going to come rolling at me? Yeah. Oh! Of course it did that. There's some more of them flowers from the Amazon that you can't get with traditional... Oh! Hello! Whoa! Oh, oh. Nice. Oh, the treasure just disappeared. Different, huh? Oh, hello. Is one gonna pop out of here? Yep. Here too? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> I didn't expect one out of that little little spot there. Ah! <laughs> it got me again! Hey, right, game. You got me. Bad. You gonna offer to take me back? No, I don't want to go back. Not after coming all this way. Okay. Oh, hey, boys. Where are we going? Bye, boys. I guess the uh, <laughs> the nephews all just plummeted to their deaths. <laughs> Or maybe that's one of those holes that isn't a hole. Sometimes those exist in this game. Why didn't gravity apply to those? Oh, hey, guy. Get wrecked. Oh, what? How am I supposed to get that now? Hey, Webby. Use the seesaw, Uncle Scrooge. Why? Is that thing gonna launch me? Yep, that's precisely what it's gonna do. Wow, really launched me. Oh, oh, does this lead back up to where um, I popped down on the other side of that hidden treasure and um, then to the left would be the boss? I bet that's what this is. I bet that that little boss that I am going to die to for a second time is right over Didn't even know bats did that. <laughs> okay. Oh, that was just me being a bonehead. That's kind of freaky because you can't really jump out of the heart until it's falling. You can't jump out of it when it's rolling, so you're trying to jump out of it, but you're like stuck in it, so it scares you. Yeah, I know. I know. Thanks, Webby. Oh, this time I'm on the screen. Last time was I on the screen? I thought I wasn't on the screen last time. I wonder if that ring is useful for something, or if it was just a bonus hidden treasure for points. Okay. Boss time. Wow, this boss is shockingly easy compared to the other bosses. Well, now the first boss was actually that easy too. Just the uh, magic of dispel was a little harder than that. Okay, that's cool. We figured out how to beat three of the levels so far. I 
How come I got two green ducks here? Why do I got two Louis? Where's Dewey? What? Why is it like that? There's two green and one red. Dewey's cosplaying. Alright, then we got the Himalayas and the moon. Oh, you can't pogo here, you get stuck in the snow. I hate this level the most. Can still kill stuff with it. <laughs> ah! Okay, we have a rope down that does not go up. Kind of looked like it went up too. Ah. Oh. All right, secret passage through the floor. But I missed the treasures. Oh, there's a one-up hidden there. That's nice. A launch pad. No, I don't want to go back. Don't even ask. This looks slippery. Yep, it's slippery. I saw you up there, Spider Bee. Ah! All the good it did me. Is this the mon is that the Monty Python rabbit? Not that deadly. The sharp, pointy fangs. for dropping that cake there, hockey player. Didn't even know the Himalayas had a hockey team. Who? Oh! Okay. There you go. I can't get up there. Go away. What the? Why did it let me come up here but not go any further than that? That looks like it's not stable. <laughs> <laughs> Called it. Oh, I think I'm probably actually supposed to go down there. I'm probably going backward through the level this way, huh? Alright, hockey player, I need another kick. Um, hockey player? Hockey players stay dead? Okay. How am I supposed to get underneath that? I lure it out and then... Oh! <laughs> really? Alright. Guess we're starting over in the Himalayas. Okay, this time we won't fall down in the pit. Oh no, I lost my health upgrade. Tragic. It doesn't seem stable. Being this last words, hey, what's going on, Chronix? <laughs> I used to say it's like I can see the future because what I know will happen is that video games will kill me, is that, or that I will do a bad job, or something like that. <laughs> I can see the future. What's going to happen is I'm going to die a bunch. If only I could find a way to make this. Prognostication uh, useful. Oh, you can't bounce here. Ah, uh, how are you doing this evening, bro? Oi! I went through that thing. You rabbit! I saw you cheat. Right, this time I'm gonna check out what's down this rope. I already went down the secret passage last time. I'm curious as to what's down this rope. Yeah, what's down here? Uh, a lot? 
of drops. Oh! Okay, this led... This is the same place that... Okay, that's interesting. This is the same place that the other... That the hidden one led me to eventually. It makes me curious to see what's on the other side of that... That... Or on the bottom of that rope, then, by launch pad. I thought I was a superhero for a while, but then I was told pattern recognition is a superpower. Luckily, I saw that conversation coming. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I feel that way with the kids all the time. I have, you know, a hundred kids. And I'm always like, don't do that. If you do that, this will happen. And then they do it. And then the thing happens. And I'm like, how is it that you don't think I'm a wizard? Like, you were there when I said it would happen. And then you were there when it happened. So why isn't your immediate reaction like, wow, Mickey is truly a prophet. They're, they're never impressed that I can see the future. Right, where's that one? There it is. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, I can just jump over there this way. Okay, so let's check out this way. What's down here? Hmm. Good thing I can bounce on those ones. Ooh, money. Money that may or may not be useful. In two out of three levels so far, money was useless. In the first one, though, it was necessary. At least as far as I know. He knew because, like me, he was once dumb enough to do the thing. <laughs> that, that may be the conclusion that they're drawing. Human pattern recognition sometimes works so well that your brain ends up tricking you. Oh, yeah. This is where superstitions come from, right? Oh, hey. What's up, Huey? Bubba's trapped in the ice. Please help him. Oh! He's probably safer trapped in the ice. Oh, come on, game. You're gonna have those dangling all over the level, and now you're gonna drop them on me? Well played. Okay, so if this is the way to go to get Bubba, what's up the other way? No, you mm. That's where the other one drops you down. Can I just walk that, or will I fall? I don't think I could have walked it. <laughs> I barely made it with that little tiny jump I did. Oops. No. I actually did want to try and get past this spider. Let's see what's over here. Yo! Yo! Killer spider! Okay, so the first way down doesn't have the one-up, but it is like a shorter way to get there. I probably should go get the one-up, though. Another, another attempt to get past the spiders. Goat! Although it does need more goats, too. Oh, you, the one that drops the ice cream drops it in the pit? Okay, never mind. I don't know. Drop ice cream. That's fine. <laughs> that was close. Oh, it's ice cream. Who cares? Get my one up. Not going to Bubba just yet. Can I? No. Useless. Ah! This spider. Okay. Another one of those NES games where, like, it's almost kind of easier to speedrun the game than play the game. Because it's like. Like. I, I, like, I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't speedrun anything. But some games, especially NES games, it seems to reward you for going faster. Like Ninja Gaiden, or Ninja Gaiden Super gave you, um, made it, the game way easier when it, on you when you went fast. Okay, what was all this, what did I do all this for? A cake that I wouldn't need if I didn't come down here. Oh, spider, what's your deal? And a treasure I don't, I don't need. 
I don't know. I don't understand how the spiders work at all. Clearly, I'm supposed to go up here because that trap wouldn't work going the other way. And there was something over here. What was it now? Just treasure. Okay, that's the uh, the thing that abandoned me. What's it doing this time? Oh gosh. Oh, it's booking. Oh, okay. That wasn't so bad. A different. Oh no, this is the boss. Okay. Abominable snowman here, but I gotta get Bubba too, right? Bubba is the one who was um, Gizmo Duck, right? Was that Bubba who said blabber and blather skanks? I can't, yeah, I can't bounce here, so I gotta bounce directly on the abominable snowman here. And we got the. Is it a crown? I don't, I don't know what that thing is. Snow globe. Bubba was the oh Bubba was the cave duck. Thank you, Gerd. Who was the uh who was Gizmo Duck? I mean I know he was like a dork and his like identity was hidden because he put on sunglasses and got cool. So oh, I guess I can't rescue Bubba now. It's too late for me to save Bubba. Blathering Oh, his name was Blathering Blabberskites? I thought that was the um the code he used to turn into Gizmo Duck. He would say, blather and blather skypes, and he would become Gizmo Duck. Yeah, that's the phrase. Okay. That's what I thought, yeah. <laughs> um, okay, let's go to the moon, I guess. How do I get up there? What? The moon? Or is it a spaceship? There's a spaceship on the moon? Who's, is that my spaceship? Is that the spaceship I came in? Or are there aliens here? I guess there are aliens here. Look at that weird one. Hey! Got another ring. Got Polter pupped again. Oh no, we got Price pupped. Hey, what's going on, Price? How are you doing this evening? Thanks for the raid. You know I'm Mickey Dad, right? I take care of kids. Ah. I die in old video games. And I make stuff out of yarn. Fenton Crackshell Cabrera. That was his name? This is this is the meme music credits? Why is this the meme music? Find Gizmo Duck's remote control. Then he can blast the wall. This wall? This wall? Gizmo Duck's remote control, huh? Price check! Can I get a price check? Fantastic. I need a cool raid message like that. Mine's just Mickey Dad Raid, which I guess works. I don't know how that works. But can I get a price tag? It's so cute. <laughs> yeah, there's aliens, alright. Okay. Tonight, so what were you up to tonight, Price? What were you playing? Oh. How is it going? Final Fantasy X? Final Fantasy X, I love Final Fantasy X. I have like five video games that I say are my video games that I can't seem to ever get tired of. And Final Fantasy X is one of mine. And I've been super... But not Blitzball! I love Blitzball. I've been super nostalgic about Final Fantasy X lately because of all the Kingdom Hearts play. Kingdom Hearts super gave me Final Fantasy X vibes. Um... And so I wanted to play Final Fantasy X. I should come, gosh, come, start it back up, and I'll come read you and watch you play Final Fantasy X. Get my fix. <laughs> is this a, a game that you've beaten before? Or is it like a first playthrough? You speed run it? What's the deal? Give me the deets. Needs to know. Ah. Can I bounce on those? Whoa, I stopped bouncing. <laughs> oh, so does this just lead back down to the moon where I was? Go back up! Oh. Yep, it, it led back down to the moon where I was. How did they even put that there? 
Okay, let's check this way. I don't remember if I actually played as a kid or if I just watched my brother play a lot. I got a lot of games like that, Price. <laughs> oh! Gosh, yeah, like, there are some games where I'm like, um, like Willow or Final Fantasy or Dragon Warrior, where I'm like, well, I definitely saw the end of that game, and I definitely played it a lot, but I don't think I beat it. I think I just did all the level grinding for my older brother, and I think he beat it. My brother did not like grinding, and I didn't mind grinding. It was like how I got to play the game, so... I was his grindmaster. If he needed 99 houses in Final Fantasy 1, I, I was gonna get them for him. <laughs> I don't know how I'm standing on that. That's what happened to me with Star Ocean till the end of time. I have never played any Star Ocean games. What system is Star Ocean for? Like, I've heard that name before, but... It's just a name to me. Oh, I don't know. PS2, oh, it goes... This is kind of like... Not exactly after my time. PS2, like, I had a PS2, I played PS2. The problem was, I just wanted to play Final Fantasy X, and maybe a little bit of Metal Gear Solid 2. So that was really all I played on PS2. And then maybe later, some Final Fantasy XI. I played some the, the online Final Fantasy with some buddies in Cherry Point. Um, until World of Warcraft came out. Then we all stopped playing Final Fantasy and started exclusively playing World of Warcraft. Okay, let's keep checking up this side of the spaceship, I guess. Woo! Yes. Oh, my goodness. Uh... I don't know how much money I gave the Blizzard over the years. The only the only time I even really like stopped playing WoW was when I started streaming because I had to spend so much time playing these games I couldn't I didn't have time to play one. There's a key inside the UFO. We can't go on without it. Okay, so I need a key to unlock that. Then I need Gizmo Drug's controller so he can break down a wall. I forgot to rescue Bubba in the Himalayas. He's trapped in the ice still, and I guess he'll stay there until Sean Astin digs him up. I had to restart my stream today because my computer was, oh no, and wanted to up during stream. Ugh. I mean, I, I've never had real big problems with my computer while I was streaming, but I've definitely had technical issues. In fact, I had technical issues today. This ROM, so I'm playing this on an EverDrive. Somehow, like, the game crashed and the ROM got corrupted. And I had to delete the ROM and re-put it back on the on the EverDrive. <laughs> Never had that happen, but today my EverDrive decided that would be fun. Ooh, what do we got here? Is this Gizmo Ducks controller? That's nothing. That's hidden treasure. Okay, that was not Gizmo Ducks controller, nor was it the key. I don't know what the hidden treasures do. I don't know if you get like a true ending with them or something. I'm not even keeping track of them really. So the key's just on the other side of the ship. Great. Oh, and you know what? I will give you that. Um, I have had a ton of issues with... I, although I think it's like more of an OBS issue. If I move any of my USB devices to any other slot on my PC, OBS throws a fit. And I can either have my webcam or my or my stream. Like one or the other. My, 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 my GB USB. I can have my game stream or my webcam, not both. And it's just the, it's like a 30 minute ordeal just to get it working again. And I, I still don't even know how to fix it. It just kind of comes back to normal eventually. After 19 restarts. Okay, let's check this side of the ship. Who said this was the meme music? Did you say why it was the meme music? Somebody said it's the meme music, but I didn't know it was meme music or why it was meme music. I did that today to try to fix it and made OBS have a couch. Yeah. You, know, you use uh, Streamlabs or Studio? I kind of feel like if I knock that over, maybe I can climb up on that wall. Oh, yeah. Streamlabs? Okay. My I used to use Streamlabs, but um, there were some, like, 
video filters that I couldn't do on Streamlabs, that I could do on Studio. But my brother, he just started, he, he wants to start streaming, and I told him to use Streamlabs, because it's like, it's more user-friendly. <laughs> But yeah, it'll, it'll... Hey, there's the key. It will throw fits like that. All the advanced alien technology and you still just use like an old brass key. So when are you going to be streaming Final Fantasy X again? I'm going to watch Final Fantasy X. What's going on, Vetch? I was watching an old... VOD of mine while I was working on... Uh, some knitting earlier today, and uh, I don't even remember what it was, Vetch, but you came into one of my chats like a year ago and made some joke, and it just had me rolling. What is this duck doing? <laughs> I can't even remember the joke now, but a year ago, Mickey thought it was hilarious. <laughs> just some just some terrible Vetch joke. It's an awful pun or something like that. Get out of the way. Could you be more in the way, please? Thank you. Don't you do it, too. No, don't kill it. Okay. I was afraid a new one would spawn. Anything over here? No? Okay. So now we can go to the other side of the UFO because we got the key. It's nice. You don't have to, like, do the full extent of the pogo bounce there. You can just do a little, little pogo bounce. <laughs> Where the key? This isn't where it was. Oh, this is where it was. So what was up there? Oh, the hidden treasure was up there. Okay. Is that the remote control for Gizmo Duck's suit? Bless me, big pipes. Now Gizmo Duck can blast that wall. Oh, that was screw saying. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah, that's yeah. rich. Yeah, one of these kind of jokes. All right, today, Melissa, you got a nail. <clears throat> Alright, you ready? You ready, Melissa? What can make splits with no legs? I feel like this isn't even a, a joke. This is probably more like a terrible riddle for five-year-olds. I don't know, maybe five-year-olds would laugh at this. I'll tell the five-year-old tomorrow this, quote, joke and see if he laughs. I don't even know if he knows what splits are, though. Live split can. Oh. <laughs> okay. So a year from now, I'm gonna watch this vod and and see when Vetch made me laugh again. Live split can make splits. A banana. It was a banana, Melissa. Not banana. Sorry. Close though. <laughs> Live split can make splits with no legs. All right. What can you call a car? that never stops. Not what do you call a car, what can you call a car? What can you call a car that never stops? Melissa, why do you keep uh, redeeming these? Yo, that octopus earned his paycheck this week. How did you get that, bitch? It was cargo. I'm, I'm disappointed you got it. I never would have got that. Go kart cargo. Oh gosh, I guess I didn't really think about it, but I quit on it before I gave it a, a, a real chance. I guess maybe if I had thought about it, I didn't want to think about it though. Cargo. These sustain me. <laughs> Is it something you're doing to me that you get something out of? No, no, go back. Okay. Oh wait, no. No, I got the... Yeah, I got the remote control. Okay, so I can go... Um, if I jump there, will I die? Okay, no, I'm good. <laughs> Only one way to find out! Game is so utopia. You think so? I don't like murdering aliens and space ducks. Huh. Wish my enemies would drop soft serve ice cream. How many enemies have you vanquished? How do you know they don't? Okay, there's Gizmo Duck. Well, thanks, Gizmo Duck. I have... I still have a grape, a banana, a... 
whatever flavor green is, maybe apple, and then a pink, whatever flavor pink is, maybe strawberry. And then I actually just bought another bag of Laffy Taffy's. They were on sale with the Halloween candy, so. I'm not running out of Laffy Taffy's, Melissa. Don't you worry. Thanks, Vetch. I crocheted that myself. I am actually crocheting a replacement, though. This one's a little, well, first of all, I made that blanket for Sarah, and then I stole it from her to use as a background. Um, I'm actually making, I'm making a new one that's sort of the colors of the little sprites behind me there, kind of a yellow, green, and purple. So it's the same style, same pattern, but it's going to be yellow, green, and purple instead of red, orange, and white. It's funny, Sarah picked those colors too, just like out of the yarns I had. And she's like, I want a fall blanket. And she picked this red and this yellow and this white. And the, the red and the yellow were named Hollyberry and Pumpkin, respectively. I was like, well, you picked fall colors. <laughs> it's going to be a fall blanket for sure. Ha! Okay, is this the boss of the moon? It's a rat, obviously. Oh, it is guarding, like, moon cheese. This rat's kind of a chump. That rat was so lame. <laughs> yes, smoked rat. Pumpkin spice blankie. <laughs> I'm gonna call it that from now on forever. Pumpkin spice blankie. It is pumpkin spice. In fact, did I call it that? I swear, when I so I had you know I have a picture on on the stream here somewhere on the channel of like latest craft. I posted a picture of this blanket when I made it, and I swear I called it Pumpkin Spice Blanket. Okay, so. Let's see what happens if I try to do Africa before Transylvania. You only want banana jokes? Is that what you're saying, Melissa? You don't want jokes from other colors? Are the, the jokes connected at all to the colors or the flavors? You need a key, kitty. Let's see if this mirror works. If I haven't beaten Transylvania yet. Oh, it does! Look at that! Okay, so that's all it takes to get the key to Transylvania. Or to the mine. Banana jokes. <laughs> well, vanilla jokes. I don't know if they do. Alright, so we've got the Himalayas beaten. Okay, so I have beaten every level. Just not all at once. No, I'm saying I don't care for the other flavors. I just want to eat banana. You want you want some banana Laffy Taffy? I'll get you some banana Laffy Taffy. I'll get you for a secret Santa this year. Okay. Goodness knows which direction I went in this place. Hoping some latent memories will kick in. There was a hidden treasure here, too. Oh, here's that treasure that I never got last time. I want it this time. There it is. Oh, good. It was just a regular $10,000. Okay. Oh. Get wrecked, bat. Oh, yeah. There's, okay. There's just some little goodies over here. Like an ice cream, I think. And some money I don't need. So, if... Oh, no, because you can't carry money between the levels. So I can't do, like, Amazon second and just run straight to the elevator. It won't work. Okay, here was a hidden treasure. Oh, no, it was a one-up. Okay. Did I ever finish going this way? Because there was a chain down this way. Whatever. Did I ever go here? Oh, it just dumps you shortcuts. Yeah, okay. Oops. No. Oh! Excellent. Cool. I did all that on purpose. I knew all of that was going to happen. Stealing my banana Laffy Taffy's. All right. I will save all the banana Laffy Taffy's for you. <laughs> and we'll play some World of Illusion. I think I'm going the wrong way, actually. I think I'll just go down here. Like, I have any idea what I'm doing. Okay, and here's where these, mm -hmm, these plucky ducks jump out of the water. I have no reason not to jump there. That was just maybe a doofus. Missed the input. Oof, indeed. 
Whoop. All right. Let's try not the secret way. Oh, and this is where Miss Beefly was just hooking ice cream all over the place. Talk about utopia, bitch. Look at all this ice cream. Oh, no, no. She throws out more ice cream than I could possibly ever need. And here I murder a bunch of plucky ducks. And there's some kind of... Yeah, hidden treasure over here. It's a, some kind of magic ring. Good night, Gert. Thanks for uh, hanging out. It's always a pleasure to have you here. Good night. And I'll catch you later. Probably in Price's chat or in Ghost Dogs. <laughs> okay, and then down there was where I came from after getting launched, and this is the boss. Looks like the uh, king of the water planet in that future on my episode. Oh, this time he's coming after me, though. Last time he didn't do this so much. This music track here reminds me of, like, Don Corneo's mansion in Final Fantasy VII. Good night, Bryce. Thanks for the raid. And definitely stream some more Final Fantasy X soon so I can come watch. Oh, look how much money I got now, Melissa. Remember when I was trying to, like, scrape up two pennies to rub together? I'm a millionaire. I'm half a billionaire. Every Friday? All right. I usually don't stream on Friday, so that'll work. Okay, uh, Transylvania, let's go get that HP upgrade. See all my money I got? Mm, filthy rich, like a Scrooge McDuck should be. Okay, where was that? Invisible wall? They had the HP upgrade. Ow! Oh. Okay, now's not the time to get wrecked. Yeah, well, let's go save Huey. Because, you know, it's canon that we do. Yeah, yeah, this house has an illusion of all time. Oh, it's been two hours? Alright. Maybe we shouldn't even stream too much longer, huh? Beat this one on Sunday. Oh, now you want to hide behind your little ball. Thanks for the ice cream, though. Hurrah! Pwned. Okay, oh, the first illusion wall was over here, right? And yeah, this is where the HP upgrade is. Excellent. Cool, because it refills my health, too. Alright. Get wrecked. Oh, nice, a one up, too. I didn't even know that was a one up. I thought it was an ice cream. Almost didn't bother getting it. What use or what? The money? Get away, ghost. Ah, ah. Yes. Get out of here, nerd. Okay. Let's go, lady. Ow, what? Why did my stick go away? Can't do that. Ugh. Did not like that. Oh! Alright, that one was just me being a doofus. I'm trying to land on her during her iframes. Ah. Whoa! I can't believe I dodged that. That was just spastic luck. Oh! Yes! <laughs> one level left, Melissa. Oh, what use is the money? No use. I, although, I don't know. Maybe when there's like a... It looks like there's room for another level at the bottom. Maybe you need a billion dollars to get into it. Or ten million dollars, not a billion. Okay. Back where we started it all. In the Amazon. Yeah, I got no money. Though. I gotta scrounge up that screw. Ah, this music sounds like an old friend now. You think so? Ye of little faith. <laughs> it wasn't even like two hours ago I thought, for sure I'll never beat this game, it's way too hard. 
now I'm... What? Where'd that block go? Now I'm an old pro. Boing, 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 boing. This game is fun. Yeah. Gosh, why didn't I bring any money with me? I got $7 million in the bank, and I only brought 134000 I mean, maybe that's how Scrooge stays rich. He, like, saves his money, doesn't walk around with $400,000 in his wallet. Maybe that's what I'm doing wrong. Maybe I gotta stop walking around with $400,000 in my wallet. Maybe I'd be a millionaire. <laughs> I'm gonna do it this time. I did it! I just had to believe and say it and do the inputs right. Oh. <laughs> and then the one where I've literally never gotten hurt before I get it. <laughs> that might be the most Mickey thing I've ever done. No, not ever. At least in the last three minutes. Ever in the last three minutes. That's okay, there's an ice cream up here. Hey, I'm not done down here. Scrooge is a miser, isn't he? So of course he's frugal. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. And he, I mean, he's like his name is Scrooge. For sure. Ah, humbug. Speaking of Scrooge. Whoop. Don't line up. Don't sink up. There we go. Got the original Mickey move there. No, no sweat. Whoop. Oh gosh. <laughs> Every time it's so freaky. Get a little more skill. Okay, so I have 264,000. Look at this one. This one's like worth more. Yeah, that one's worth 50k. There's like a darker color to it, look like. Ah, ah, it ruined my bounce. Ah, okay, that one was me ruining my own bounce. Alright. I'm gonna get the M. Somebody drop me an ice cream. Or a cake. Thank you. Cool. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's your money. Come on. Let me up there. Hello, Dewey. I will. I will do that. Okay. Run, 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 run. Or just, you know, saunter. Flamo. Alright, treasure keeper. Let's do it. <laughs> no, I didn't get, like, dinked that time. Oh, I got it. It happened that time, huh? Alright, so there should be like like one ultimate level now, right? Like obviously Glomgold has gotta be the final boss of the game. He was Scrooge's nemesis, right? All land clear. Oh okay, I'm done with these treasures now, I guess. Bye treasures. I went through all the work of getting these treasures. This is very Mega Man. Haha, ha, if you want to get back the treasures, come to Dracula Duck Manor. Dracula Duck? It's not Glomgold? This is just Transylvania again. Weird. Okay. Was there a mirror I like never went in last time? Or? Ghost? Could you chill? Yeah. Oh. I'm gonna need some refreshment here. <laughs> um. 
gosh, all this just to, all I did accomplish coming down this way was lose a bunch of hit points. Well, and learn that I wasn't supposed to come down this way, so. Valuable lesson. Yeah, not that way. No Huey at all. Did my M come back by any chance? Could really go for an M. Nope. Hey, Micah. I wonder if I can leave that M there earlier in the game and come back and get an M. Get wrecked. Oh, thank you. Okay. Then, oh, the hidden wall. The health upgrade was over here. I sure wasted that ice cream, didn't I? But that's it. Nothing else. Okay. I guess we're just gonna go back to where we fought <coughs> Magic of the Spell. <coughs> Excuse me. Hmm. I mean, there was some stuff over there. Oh, wait. Maybe this one now? Is it? Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, wait. No, I already did this one. Not that secret oh no, this is what just leads to the other side. This was senseless. No treasures here, no nothings. And the other one dumps you over here. Take me there. <laughs> Mackie, what are you barking at? Scared me, bud. <laughs> oh, no! I'm gonna bounce off that one. Alright, so not in there. I feel like maybe I'm just supposed to go to where Magic was. There's also the potential, like, of that one on the left there. Although I feel like it took me kind of the same place the, uh, the one I just jumped into took me. in my life. Ah, okay. Alright, so is this vampire duck now? Okay, there's something here. Oh, hello. Oh, and he's got bats. Oh, oh. If I had done that, like, way, way earlier, that might have worked. Oh, come on, bro! Oh. Barely had a chance at that one. Okay, there we go. That'll do it. There's like invisible stuff on the ceiling. <laughs> okay. Gotta time that just right. Vampire duck, huh? Where'd this goon come from? Get out of here, ghost. And you too, next ghost. Ah, oh, I didn't know if it was going to go up or down. All right. Well, there goes one of my vampire hit points. That bat's way too high. Come on. You've got to hook me up better than that. Do I have to, like... Oh, i got to, like, lurk down there for the bats to come down to me. That one's, okay, that one flew a little weird. All right. Give it a little jump. That, that's good. Oh, okay. Now... Hey, bat? Did you don't? Ah, I got greedy. Bring that bat down here. No. Ah. Oh, now I got a cooperative bat and I wasted it. Come on. Ooh, that one was close. Nope, not that one. Nope, that was my own fault. I really like those middle bats. The ones in the middle, right there. Eh, that was a little too high for me. I was a little hesitant about it. It's not like I'm gonna run out of time here. <laughs> maybe I will. I mean, it hits this boss takes, I guess. Uh, I maybe could have used that one. Ah, uh, this one's too slow. By the time I get to him, he's gonna be in his 
vanishing. Okay. Where'd he go? What? It was Glomgold! It was totally Glomgold with magic of the spell. <laughs> you may have beaten Dracula Duck, but not me. Oh, wait. Or that was Dracula Duck, and now Glomgold showed up? If you want the treasures back, you'll have to catch me. Well, let's go catch it. Um, what? Was that a race? Like, I was climbing that, but it wasn't much of a race. Did I just beat the game? He looks pretty happy. He's got a big old chest full of gold. Scrooge remains the richest duck in the world. Oh, good. That's, that's what was important. Daring explorer Scrooge McDuck has found the five legendary treasures making him the richest duck in the world. Uh, oops, didn't read it fast enough. Hooray, Uncle Scrooge! Thanks, Melissa! We're glad you found the treasures, but don't forget we helped too. Yeah, he got kidnapped. And I didn't even see Louie. There were two Louis in the computer room. Right, lads, I couldn't have done it without you. I really am the richest duck in... Aww, the real treasure was the nephews who don't have parents. Airplanes, it's a duck blur. Might solve a mystery. For rewrite history, DuckTales, woo! They out make American DuckTales, woo! Tales of Daring Do, Bad and Good Luck Tales? Fantastic. Well, that went swimmingly. Now I don't even have to stream on Sunday, huh? No confidence. Webby who? Gizmo Duck who? Ms. Beakley and Launch Pad McQuack, who? Just the nephews. because I need buddy crates. And because you need radishes so you can keep getting those sweet, sweet jokes. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, I should probably be back on Sunday. If I'm not, don't be mad, though. But maybe I will be. <laughs> Good night.